Hey guys, guess who's back? Back in the motor vlogs. Back in the game. In his new 636. Oh man, listen to that. So, today's video, guys, is a quickie. Because I'm into them quickies, you know what I mean? That two second shooter, man. Yeah, go, son. Look. Look, this is how a biker should be, man. Real nice. So you get the wave. And then get the green light. Yeah, man, karma. I gotta believe in karma. So today's video is called upshifting. It's called quick shifting without a quick shifter. Upshifting with no clutch. Ready? One, three, four, five. That's some smooth shifting, guys. And that's no ease. Oh, this man wanna race me, man. This guy, this guy is Audi, man. He's like, oh man, I'll race you, son. I'll race you, son. You can't race me, boy. I'm too fast. As you guys remember, I used to have a Ninja 300. That's long gone. I'm making real gains now, real speed gains with my new bike, Ninja 636 2013. So yeah guys, you can upshift without, a, without using the clutch, I have been practicing lately. You, what you gotta do, what you got to do, is let go of the throttle, so you can hear it hopefully on the video, put the device up, hopefully you can hear it there. So I'm in fifth gear right now, alright. My hands are right here in the camera, see? I'll keep it here, ready? There you go, six gear. So, what it does is basically, you literally let, you just throttle off for about half a second. And, it's, and while, just before you throttle off, you just apply pressure up on the gear shift. So, you don't do it all in one go. You have to slowly, you're already slowly applying a little bit of pressure to the you know, to the gear shifter, and then you just push up just when you let go of the throttle. So as soon as you throttle off, you push up and let go. It's a very small, minor movement, but it allows uh, gears not to crunch and it just pops right into the next gear. Um, when you first start practicing, you start ramming him up and down, and yeah, you might hit you might hit uh, neutral, which I have done a couple times. But usually, as long as your revs are up high, I mean, you know, if you can do it at low revs, but it's definitely much harder. As long as your revs are up high, you're all Gucci. You are Gucci, my friend. So let's give it a few more upshifts up here. I'll put my arm up so you guys see I ain't fucking doing nothing. So one, two, three. Straight up the six gear. See that? Smooth. No over rev, no nothing. So this allows you that when you're doing a little, you know, quick acceleration, you can do it real fast without having to worry about clutching in. Definitely saves a lot of time to your upshifts. Gets you up to speed real quick. What the hell this guy's, what's going on up here? Oh, we, oh, this guy's, this guy's roof is coming down. We missed it boys. We missed it boys. Anyway, that was it for today, guys. So, hopefully you enjoyed that short video, and I'll speak to you soon, boys. Weekly videos will be coming up on all my weekly accidents and happenings and close calls. And hopefully once a week, I'll do a topic as well. Peace.